Hey guys, so the video I put up yesterday that I posted yesterday, um, after I made that video, I felt like a burden had been lifted off of me. Like literally a ton of bricks felt like was off and I, I could breathe. And it, it was so, um, mm, but all I could do was just go and meditate and get into the word and, um, I felt free. I felt released. I think is the best way that I could put it. And um, I feel like that that was me forgiving myself and not holding on to what me and my children are going through because at the end of the day, it's going to work itself out. This, everything that's happening is in the Bible. It's right there. So, the only thing I can do is just stay prayerful. Keep them lifted up in, in, in God's hands. Because I can't, that's a battle. I can't even... I did my part. I did everything I could do. So now it's, it's up to God. And it's got to work its course out. There's nothing I can do. I can't make it. I can't force it. I can't make them see that I was in pain too. You know, uh, from a mother's side of things. You know, I, I could try and tell them, but you know, it, and just, you know, when you have good, I had good intentions. It was never my intentions to make uh, my kids growing up uh, miserable. So I had to forgive myself for that. Because if I don't forgive myself for that, when they need me to be there for them, when they are ready to really, really heal and let it go, I gotta be strong enough to do that. Because at the end of the day, God still made me the mother. So I still have responsibility. Like I told one of my passengers, I said, no matter what things I go through, my job and my duties and my responsibilities to my children don't stop. I don't stop teaching lessons. I don't stop being their role model until I'm six feet under. Every relationship has its growing pains and these are ours. And I don't embrace them I, as I did. I own them and now I must let them go. So, I want you fancy beauties and bows to enjoy the rest of this video. Thank you so much for sending me your warm thoughts and keeping me in prayer and my family in prayer. It's not enough that, that this world when you can say it's enough prayers no it ain't no it ain't and so I thank you guys for that know that I love you and know that I have you in my heart as a part of my family a part of my growth a part of my freedom 
journey. This is now going to be my freedom journey. And I'm holding on to God's hand with all the strength that I have in my body. So I hope you guys stick around for that journey, whether it's bump, more bumps in the road or if it's smooth sailing from here on out. We're going to do it in, in Jesus' name. All right, y'all. I love you. Let's go outside We can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Is coming to visit. No, he wouldn't miss this in Christmas times. Oh, and the sun said it is just getting better on a blanket with the skyline painted in blue. Ooh, yeah, that's what we do. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Santa's gonna come and join us in this song. Oh, yeah.